What exactly is happening on your road? I'll tell you exactly what is happening on our road. What is happening in Antony Road is a very narrow strip. Yes. And that has no footpath. Yes. And now that they're having no footpath, the road is so narrow, the schools are all there around the corner, and the buses are going up and down, up and down there. Yes. And the bus going up and down, and the cars going up and down, and right. nowadays all big cars are, are, are more in Mandy and small cars. Right. Due right. to that, what is happening is there is no footpath where the public is going to walk. Exactly. The public has a very problem. The other day I heard a lady shouting in the afternoon. So I ran out to see. I thought she was being robbed or molested or something. Went to see. She was very on the corner between the wall and the bus. Then the public all got together and told the bus driver, you wait. Then they sorted out. Then they something. So how, how far is this road from your house? From my house it is just across the road. Okay, okay. Just across the road on the other side. And that road leads to manual and service road. Yes. Because of that, I, in fact, I've gone and spoken to the traffic officer, Mr. Chauhan, Senior Inspector Chauhan. So he only heard me out. He didn't give me any proper response whether he's going to attend to it or no. Yes, yes. The fact is, I went and met him. Then the second time I went to give him a reminder, he was not available, his assistant was there. He's also Chauhan. No, so actually, uh, what do you feel is the solution? The solution I wanted, ah, that's a very good question he put to me. He, I asked him, I said, you, you put a board on top. Yes. Where? On the lamppost, which saves you the expense of putting a beam and all. Put it on the lamppost there only. No parking. And one road you put up in the Alvarez Villa is where no cars are being. Second time the witness functions in the school, Arya Mandi school. So happens that what is happening? Every of these people come and park like and lock the car and go. Hmm. Now if a car is locked in that very narrow road and a bus comes and the cars are coming from upstairs. Nowadays all people are having big, big cars. Very problem for them, you have public to walk. Where will they walk? Yes. Every time you hear shouting at any odd time, because of the inconvenience put in by uh, the traffic, because they are parked anywhere. Now, Chavan has not given me a proper answer, the chief, the senior, and even his assistant has not given me a proper answer. He said, only said, we'll look into it. But now I went to see him a second time, I didn't meet the senior man, I met his assistant. He's a gentleman from Bandra staying in Bandra quarters and he said that he's going to look into it. Now let's see. Now I met Baba just now. I told Baba about it. Baba said, I'll see the boards are put up. And he said, who's your corporate? I told her. She called for Carol and told Carol, we'll follow up with that. And if you have a problem about Baba the boards, you come to me. So now this is what I hope now after meeting the MLA, Baba, plus meeting our Carol, that things are going to work. Something will be done about it. Something here. should be done about it. I, I believe it, don't let an accident take place. I told yeah. even the senior inspector. Yeah. I said, you know what happened at Pretty School? A lady was very well with her child and the bus was reversing. And she was getting pressed, she pushed her child one side and she died. You know about that case? I don't know. Died, she died. And then you all have put up all the doors, no parking, no parking. Now, after the incident take place, so you, you should want not... it to happen on our road and then yeah. the eyes to open So up. basically, you should not wait for something to happen right. and then... You said the right thing, you should wait for something. Preemptive, preemptive, yeah. yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.